Hey guys, today I wanted to update on Kylie Rodney on her case. And as you know, the last I talked about this case, her car was found and her body was found by some YouTubers who search for missing people. Um in lakes and water, bodies of water. So they found her in Lake Prosser. And so when they found her, the people who found her immediately said that it was suspicious because she was in the back of the car and most of the people they find are in the driver's seat. So they immediately said it was suspicious. And just hearing it, it does kind of sound suspicious. But I was thinking about how I watched this show one time. And they put somebody in a car and put them in the water to see how long it would take for the car to fill up with water. It was kind of like a survival show. Well, what happens is the water fills up real, or the car fills up really slow. And there's usually an air pocket. So they said her car was found upside down. And I'm thinking, that might put the air pocket in the back seat near the floorboard. Possibly she went back there and was found back there because she was trying to survive and was looking for the air in the car. So in a way, this is, to me, it kind of looks like she accidentally went into the water and when she found out the car was filling up with water she was looking for air a way to get out because I hear that your car it's hard to open the door until the car is completely filled with water because of the pressure so she might have tried the door and couldn't get out and sadly ended up in the back trying to find air um this is just my first thoughts on it i'm thinking too the people that they usually find that are still in the driver's seat possibly are people who went into the lake or water on purpose so they're not going to like try to find the pocket of air they're not going to try to find a way out so they just stay in their driver's seat sometimes even buckled in so maybe that's why her case looks suspicious is because she actually didn't drive in there on purpose Now, it could mean one of two things, like she was drunk and just took a wrong turn, or it could still be foul play that someone put her in that water and she tried to get out. So I'm still looking into that part, but I wanted to bring up the thought I had of why she might have been in her back seat. And I almost think, too, like, if you volunteer to try to find her, I don't know that it's good to go and give your theories until you know all the evidence. Like, the police are the ones that should look at all the evidence. But I do think it's great they found her. I'm just saying... Now there's a lot of suspicion because of what they initially said. 
so I just wanted to give my thoughts on the whole idea of her being found in the back seat. So subscribe if you're new and I'll see you in the next one.